Okay. After paying the worker's salary, mm -hmm. I would like to take you out on a special day. Really, you feel really nice. As long as I'm with you, sweetie, I'm so happy. I, I have enough of spending on you today, oh, you know? Okay. What money? Where is the 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 money? What's happening? What I should have done a long time ago, Dennis. I'm so sorry. But I can't spend the rest of my life waiting for you to decide whether or not to marry me. I've taken my payment for the service which Okay. Please, please. Tisha, but...
Never worry, it's one of those things. Okay? Thank you. Um, oh. um, honestly, I have not seen it. It's a rare benevolence. I've not seen where a young lady in our time, you know, we offer such, you know, without, you know, I'm surprised. Thank you very much. What's your name? I'm Dennis. Oh, I'm Cynthia. Biden. Uh, sorry, Cynthia. Yeah? I, I want to know you, okay? It's turning something inside of me. I want to be your friend. <laughs> Wait, wait, I can see you're crazy, okay? I, I mean, what do you take me for? You think I'm a cheap girl or something? Eh? Look, I, when I saw you in that bus, I thought you were responsible and I could take care of your fare. But right now, I can see why you can't take care of your fare. Please, please, you're pissing me off. Relax, Place now. Um, yes, <clears throat> you remember my friend. No, we have this is my cousin. Because you remember my cousin I was telling you about. The mom is um look, uh, that's my fancy. Huh? Okay. So just, just hang on. So no, as I was saying, you, you just greet your mommy for me, okay? Yeah. I'll bring all those things for you. Okay. Look, um, I was just going to come over to your place and then I, I was already in the car and then my cousin came around and I had to give her some time. You know how it is with family people, you know, so I had to just attend to her and, you know, good. But come on, let's go inside, okay? Come on. Okay. That's my girl. But I can't wait to see you. I was already in the car, I was on my way. Eh? 
Deniz! 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 What is it? Deniz! Who what, what is the matter again? Oh, you're asking what the matter is. Look, you can't rule sweep police. Look how this dirty this place is. I swear you can't pay. Toilet, you can't wash. Now look, look, you can't you sweep this? Okay, I said let me go and buy what I'll eat after preparing, then I will I will just settle down and sweep it. It is my house. Why why? What is So you want to leave this place that is you want to eat? How can you leave when this place is dirty like this? What kind of woman being are you? Okay, ah uh, what? Can't I just go and prepare what I'll eat? Look, after preparing, then I'll come and I can't sweep. Dennis. You're asking me a question. Eh? Wait, I will get you that bus to teach you a lesson. Maybe you have forgotten that in this area, I am the area father. I will show you. See, you know, go dress a beg. You see, you go just wait for me, small. Make her go that down, down. Go buy the plug. Oh. I beg. Eh? I start to go now. Hurry up, bro. Just wait. No, no, no. no. <laughs>
Dennis, I I want to thank you for showing concern for me. I mean, it just seems as if you're my doctor and I'm your patient. <laughs> for sure, I am not a doctor, you know. I just been a while since I saw you. I mean, the last time I brought you home, so I kind of got worried. And I wanted to know how you're feeling and how you're doing. Well, as you can see, I'm a lot better now. Yeah. I actually resume work tomorrow. Really? <laughs> yes. When are you much more stronger than the previous day? I see. Dennis, I'd like to repay your kindness by coming to pay you a visit once I'm settled back into work. I'll really be nice, Susie. Um, I gotta go now. Thank you. Oh, Galan Lord, 
It's Dennis. It's Dennis. For the past one month now, he has been eating food in my shop on credit. And he hasn't paid. I'm taking this television for my money. Dennis. Is that true? Oh, God, landlord. Yeah, I hope. <sighs> Mom boy. Please. Give him some more time to pay you. Don't take the television away, eh? Please, eh? Be a bit more patient. Once he receives his salary, he'll pay you your money. Please. <laughs> Just thank your landlord. Thank your landlord and this auntie here. If not, I will have taken your television away. Idiot. And the next time I come here, eh? If you never pay, you will see what I will do to you. Dennis, it's not for me that this man will have taken your television away. That is how you be only running up and down here and there. Then see now, pack out of this compound, useless man. Um, I want to thank you for making our time to come to look me out today. Yes. I honestly apologize for what's happened out there. Sorry if I missed you. Come on, Dennis. You did not embarrass me. I understand what it is to live in today's Nigeria. I believe that the problems we are going through now will make us stronger for, for the future. I understand what it feels like to be broke. I understand. I like the way you handle the woman's hostility though. Oh no, no, that woman can be very embarrassing sometimes. Don't mind her. Uh, so you need to go by a taxi or Kada. Uh, okay. Or Kada, okay. Um, yes, we get some. Okay. 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 Thank you. like that without the club. I mean especially as she was attacked by armed robbers. I mean by area boys and beating up as well. Attacked? Yeah. How come? Look, I, I'm so sorry I had no idea. Look I, I had to go to the village. You know my mom says hypertensive okay. I'm sorry. You should have at least called to let me know. Oh, look you know these things happen just like that. It was so urgent I just had to dash out of town. Look I just came in now. I drove all the way here straight here. I'm sorry. Anyway Here's your chance to thank the man that saved your girl's life. So you had mm. better start thanking him. Mm. Hello, sir. Yeah, well, yeah, good um, day. Yes, sir. Uh, 
they are left to me, so Dennis, the guy that saved my life. Dennis, this is Chicken Dennis. Thank you very much. I really do appreciate it. Okay. Uh, uh, who you are? It's nothing, sir. It was God that used me to save a girl. Yes, I know. Right? Uh, who, why do we celebrate? You know, this calls for a celebration. Yeah, maybe we should have that. Sounds alright. Let's go out and get some drinks and that. Yeah, but maybe we should start now. You know, go inside, buy yeah. some drinks and just party. Yeah. It's all good. You don't go out there. Yeah, I appreciate it. One love, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, my dear. Thank you. 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 Thank
Yes, come in. Oh, Susan. Surprise, surprise. Welcome. Sit up, please. Look, Dennis. I want to apologize for Chike's attitude. But what I still don't get is what actually caused the quarrel. No, it's nothing, Susan, please. It's uh, just, uh, you know, mere quarrels. I mean, men man to man talk. I mean, nothing more than that. Just. Oh, I don't get it. I don't understand all this. I mean, you guys barely know each other. And all of a sudden, you guys started fighting in the club. I see there were some miles. Dennis, I know you're hiding something from me. But I'm going to get to the root of this matter. How can Chiki do this to you? How can he do this to you? No, 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 Susan, please. Uh, it's nothing, okay? I mean, just end all of nothing. Dennis, it is something. Look at how nice you've been to me. Why is he being so ungrateful? Why? Anyway, I'll see you later. I'm going to his house right now. No, this is Susan. <coughs> And I am not afraid to try it on my own And I don't care if I'm right or wrong I live my life the way I feel No matter I keep it real Everything is going to be just fine, trust me Alright? I'm crying. How could he, okay? How could you keep doing this today? You didn't even show any feelings for me. You didn't even show any respect. No respect. No, Susan. Let's face reality now. Chiki does not love you. He has never loved you. Can't you see? Well, Dennis caught him cheating on you at the club the other day. That was why they had their quarrel. And you never told me. Key. I'm sorry, Susan. Oh. I'm sorry. I you know I should have told you, but I didn't want to spoil everything for you. I know exactly how you feel about Chiki. I know you love Chiki so much. I don't want to spoil that. I mean, we just think that will happen happened. If not, I mean, you're married to Chiki would have been a disaster. It's true. Put yourself together. And just move on, okay? It's not the end of the world. I mean, who knows your Mr. Wright could just be walking right now. So just put yourself together, okay?
I went home and found out my mom wasn't well. That was actually quite a sense for me. But she's okay now. And you? How are you? How have you been? I've been, I've been fine. I've been managing. What about Dennis? Have you seen him lately? Oh, sure. I saw him yesterday. In fact, almost every other day. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Tell me about it. Hmm? Okay, you won't believe it. Ever since you traveled, Dennis has been coming around to help me. Oh. It's been fantastic. Mm. Who knows? Maybe he likes you. Tell me, what do, you, what do you think about him? How do you mean? You know damn well what I'm talking about, girl. Do you like him? Yes, I do like him. He's my friend, isn't he? Come on, Susan. Don't believe that. You know exactly what I'm talking about. I mean, do you have feelings for him? Yeah? Oh, Susan, don't start. I mean, he obviously likes you, you know that. Can't you see the man in him? He's gentle, loving, caring. What else do you need? I know he's not rich, but for God's sake, he's making a living, Susan. Well, I think you should give him a chance to ask you. Really. Sincerely, Susan. Ever since I met you, uh, something started inside of me. But I, I, I couldn't just say it to you because I, I didn't want to destroy or spoil or break anybody's relationship. But I've always wished for somebody with so much love and care, you know? Susie? Please say something. Honestly, Dennis. See, ever since Chike treated me with so much cruelty, I've had a problem with men and relationships. Chike appeared to be nice. So nice at first. But somehow, somewhere along the line, he changed. I understand how you feel, Susan. I understand how you feel. And I'm beginning to think we share something in common. I mean, kind of, we share some similarities here. I believe ever since I've been dating or having girlfriends, I've never really seen any of them that loves me for me. It's, it's been difficult, you know. Susan, no matter how hard we try, we can never find real love like we share here. From the very first day I set my eyes on you, I knew right there that you're the one for me. It's in the way you smile. In the way you walk My heart skipped a beat You knocked me off my feet I wished you'd be mine A real love Is one that is true A real love Is someone like Tell me, 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 tell me
tell you all about it. Please, I can't wait. What are you talking about, Sir I know what I'm talking about. What's he like? Is he nice? Is he kind? Is he okay, 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 okay. Calm down. Okay. We'll tell you. He's very nice. Yeah. He's very hardworking. Yeah. Um, Is that all? Take it easy, okay? okay. <sighs> we'll sleep, okay? Ever since I've moved in with Dennis, mm -hmm. every day brings more joy and more happiness. I'm fine. He's just managing to survive. Why oh, makes this so beautiful with his sincerity and his hard work? Oh, that's my girl. You know, you know, I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy that you finally got what you're looking for. We have to hold him with both hands, okay? Don't let him slip off your fingers for any reason. Hi. And you have to submit this file, okay? Oh, no, man. I'm coming back from watches. I'm going to watch <laughs> We can always do it. You know we are reliable. Yes. Okay. I'll see you. Morning, Susan. Are the estimates for the contract ready? Um, they're not quite ready, sir. Oh, oh. But, oh, ah, Susan, what is going on? What is wrong with you? Your work rate is dwindling by the day. What is happening? Those estimates are supposed to be ready by now. How huh, Susan? I'm sorry, sir. Um, I'll have them ready by the end of work today. You better do that. I will, sir. Because you know what is at stake. Yes, sir. I'm looking for Mr. Dennis Abel. Mr. Dennis Abel. Dennis. Okay. Now, that's man. I'll go. I'll call out for you. Sorry, I, I, I got you to worry overnight, okay? Sorry. You should have at least let me know. Oh, yes, we had to do over time yesterday. I mean, it, it stayed over to, to the night, okay? So I had to sleep here. I'm intending this morning to come to the house and see you. I'm sorry, okay? I'm waiting for the coffee, man. <clears throat> I'll grab all the weapons, yeah, sir. Uh, Uncle, I'll get this is uh, Susan, the lady I introduced to you as my fiancée. Uh, Susie, 
That's Mr. Bode, my boss. Oh, He's the contractor here. Good afternoon, sir. What a beautiful lady you are. Thank you, sir. <laughs> I hope you are taking good care of you. Yes, sir. Okay. Um, but I will have to leave both of you now. Okay. When you are through with her, please try and see me, huh? Okay, sir. Like you. Yeah, he can't do without me here. Yeah. Oh, and whenever he comes here, he doesn't sit down his eye. Yes. I'll see you when I come back at night. Yeah. Oh, I'm okay, it's just that I've got and I'm not free to do. Susan. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Can I give you a ride home? Sure, why not? <laughs> thank you very much. I hardly sleep these days. Why is that? That's really serious. Have you seen a doctor? Um, of course. But uh, they couldn't find anything wrong with me. Really? Well, I think I know my problem. My problem is you. Me? Look. Susan, since ever I set my eyes on you at this site, I've never been doing anything right. Susan, I'm in love with you. Have you seen me? You're joking, right? You're joking. Joking? I don't want to joke. Look. I love you. Just mention sure anything you want and I will, I, will, I will give it to you. And it shall be yours in no time. I'm really disappointed in you. I'm really disappointed at your words. I thought you genuinely liked Dennis. Of course I like Dennis. But you know Dennis cannot take good care of a, a, a beautiful girl like you. Look. He, he doesn't have to know that we are together. Mm. You know what, Mr. Bode? I'd rather stay with Dennis. He's poor, yes. But I'd rather be with you than be with you, silly fool. Look, Susan, Go to hell with your money. Stop me here. Susan. Stop me here! Don't touch me! Idiot! You flesh like Okay. 
Mr. Bode was not around, so I had to stand in for him. Yeah, Mr. Bode. What? Susie, what about Bode? What happened? Well, Mr. Bode tried to seduce me the other day. He gave me a ride home. What? It was nothing. He tried and he didn't succeed. Are you sure he didn't do anything for me? Come on. Fine, he talked and talked and talked and talked. I mean, I told him up, I told him up very well. And that's it. Dennis! I'm here for my rent. Good evening, sir. There's nothing good about this evening. Dennis! I'm here for my rent. Two months rent! But, but you know, I'm, I've been trying to put these monies together so I can pay everything. I'm working hard, Ogalan. Honestly, I'm sorry that I'm not, I've not paid. Ogalan, Lord, please, eh? Give us some time. It's just that his salary has not been paid. Yeah, yeah. Shut up. I'm not talking to you. Dennis, this matter is getting too long. I've been patient. In fact, over patient. If I don't get my money now, we prepare what happened next. What talk to you. Okay, okay, wait, okay. Please, eh? Uh, just wait for me here. Give me a minute. Come on. Thanks. Thanks. You, thanks. I can't beg you now. Stop it! Would I see my girl? Why would you pay her? You will not. You're a madman. Please. I know that I wronged you, okay? No! Wronged me? That is the statement of the year. Let me tell you what you did. You took my heart and tore it into pieces. Look, let, let's not go back into the past, okay? Please. Your past is going to come back to you, Chichi. I promise you that. Susan, please, don't you do Yes, we will. Don't do this. I know that I messed up, okay? I, I really messed up. I'm sorry. I've not been able to think. I, I, these past few weeks I've been hell. So you are my life. You are everything to me. You're, and you're going to remain in that hell. Do you understand me? Stop, please. Stop, please. Don't Get out! So, I'm sorry. I mean it this time. I'm really sorry. Get out! I beg you, please. I'll never do that. I'm sorry. It will never happen. Susan? What is it? I lost my job. What? But it's sad to me. Why? It's sad. They want me to reduce the workforce. I mean, there are too many of us around, so... The bastard! If 
loyalty to because I refused his advances. How can he be so wicked? How can he be? The worst is that they said they're not paying our salary till next weekend. I don't have any money with me. So how do I cope? I mean, how do I feed? How do I take care of you? How do I take care of us? What's happening to us?
job to so early? Um, a friend told me about a job opening in a factory at Agege, so I have to check it out. Not even breakfast? Not to worry, okay? They say the earlier, the better. Okay. To be careful. All right? Thank you. Yeah. Wish me luck. By the police. What? He and a shop attendant, they were fighting. Uncle Dennis destroyed and scattered everything in the shop. The owner of the shop came and called in the police. He has been arrested. Do you know the police station? Yes, I know the place. Please, sir. You're going to take me there. Let me just get my bullets. Wait for me. From the very first day I set my eyes on you I knew right there that you're the one for me It's in the way you smile, in the way you walk My heart skipped a beat, you knocked me off my feet I wished you'd be mine. I realized Darling, what's the matter? That is true. I realized What? Why? Why did they suck you? We had a client's meeting the other day at the office. And I had the proposal files to the contract. But because I had to bail you from the police station, we lost the contract. No. Tell us why. Why are all these things happening to us? God! It's not Past few weeks have been of one torment after another. Now I finally lost my job. It's just like, just as if the whole world is in a secret conspiracy to frustrate every move we make. It can't be, Susan. It can't be. No matter how dark the night is, the dawn will definitely come. Do you understand that? There's a letter of commendation to my friend. I hear they are looking for new, you know, people in their office, you know, for managerial posts. Take this letter to him. You'll get, you'll get the job, definitely. I hear they pay very well, but make sure you go first thing in the morning, okay? Don't worry, you'll be alright. Hey, Bookie. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're a true friend. It's okay. Just look at us. Dennis and I are both jobless. All my savings have gone into a battle for survival. Okay, thank you. It's alright. Thank you. Oh, God will bless you. Thank you. Perhaps we are going now. Take care of yourself. I'll see you Dennis. Dennis has been knocked down by a car. What? They've taken him to the hospital. Ah, where? How? 
It's serious. Let's go. Let's go. Auntie Susan. We're here to see a patient, Mr. Dennis Abel. Dennis Abel, yes. Dennis Abel. Dennis Abel. Sorry, madam, but there's no new patient by that name here. Are you sure they brought him here? Yes, yes, Auntie Susan. I'm sure he was brought to this hospital. Um, nurse, please, uh, just help us check again. He's an accident victim and he might be in the emergency ward. Huh? I'm sorry, madam, but as I said, there's no name like that here. I've been on duty since morning. Please check once again. What's, what's going on here? Nothing, my dear. told me you had an accident and you were rushed. Shh. This is no time for too many talks, okay? I've got something to show you. Okay? Come with me. Dennis. What's, what's really happening?
welcome. Welcome. Dennis. I do. Dennis, you're welcome. Thank you. Sissy, you're welcome. What's up? Hey, what's up? Yes, you're Welcome, Jenna, Jenna. Okay, I'll be back. I'll get it. No, okay. Show it all, boy, inside. Doing here. Oh, come on, Susie, there's no need to be scared or anything, okay? Uh, there are some special people I want you to meet. You know, there's some people very special to my heart. I want you to, to, to meet them, okay? Oh my god! The ah. baby is back! Oh, the baby is back! I missed you! Nice, Hi, Hi, You're welcome. Mm. This is my true love. The woman I would like to spend the rest of my life with. Mm. Mm. Susie, meet my dad and my mom here. You're welcome. Thank you. Please sleep. Yes, sit down. Sit down. Make yourself at home. Yeah. <laughs> uh, dad, if you don't mind, uh, I'd like to take her upstairs and show her some places. Yes, go ahead, go ahead. All right, yes. Honey, come on. Sure. What are you waiting for? Go and prepare something good for you. I will tell him something special. Oh, I special. Not oh. not. And you go to the fridge. You know that wine and I bought in Germany. Yeah, that. She's a person to attend the visitor. Uh, <laughs> From the very first day I set my eyes on you. ago, my fiancée Trisha messed me up. What I mean, I made up my mind to have anything to do with any woman whatsoever no, but my parents won't let me be they kept pushing me so darling I went in search of love and I found you this is all a joke right oh of course it can be a joke I mean this is the real me the man and woman you met downstairs, that's my father and my mother for you. And this is my home, that's my place, okay? So you're welcome. No, this is unbelievable. What? You see, my dad is a major shareholder in the company he worked for. So I asked the manager to assist me, you know. Susan, what is wrong with you? Your job rate is dwindling by the day. Congratulations, you're welcome. 
The sack letter is invalid because the job is still waiting. Okay. Well, um, Mr. Pade. Care of you. Susan, I'm in love with you. Don't you don't you don't you don't you 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 but he's my very good friend. Okay, the building site, I mean the construction site where I worked, happened to be my personal building. But there is Coincidentally, is working for me, you know. <laughs> He's helping me to see through the project. And, um, I'm a bomb boy, yes. Just thank your landlord. Thank your landlord and this auntie here. If not, I will have taken your television away. Good job. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Her real name is Maria, you know. She's a cook in the house. She should be somewhere, you know. You know, just that, and also uh, Sergeant Ado. Sergeant Ado. You dragged me through emotional and physical torture just to make sure that I really loved you. How could you do this, Dennis? How could you do this to me? But it's okay, honey. I mean, you love me. I've loved you. We discovered each other. Isn't that okay? Listen to me. You're a coward and you're a liar. I don't ever want to see you near me again. And if you ever come near me, I swear to God, the consequences will be funny. Do you understand me? From the very first day I set my eyes on you. I knew right there that you're the one for me It's in the way you smile In the way you walk My heart skipped a beat You knocked me off my feet I wished you'd be mine I
minutes ago. Hi. My name is Henry. What's your name? My name is Janet. May I help you? Janet? Uh, anyway, Janet, I... I saw you over there and uh, I decided to come and chat you. I... I like you. And I mean, I want us to be friends. Good friends. Actually, I don't talk to strangers, and I don't know why I'm talking to you right now. Okay, rather, should we say it's love at first sight? <laughs> love. <laughs> Whatever. Can I buy you more things? No, no, no. no. no I'm okay, really. I'm okay. I'm okay. Well, it's my attitude as a person, right? To do what I'm asking you to do now. Okay, if you insist. Yes, I do. Deception. What was all that for? Why? It's okay. hmm? Why? Dennis put me through hell and went on touching. Just to prove a lousy, stupid point. I spent all my money. I spent all my time just making a man. Now I find out that he's fake. I'm sure Dennis didn't hurt you intentionally. I'm sure he didn't do that on purpose. Oh, well, he's a liar, okay? It's okay. He's a liar. All this time I lived with him, I believe we could make a better future together. All I wanted was a simple, nice young man to love and be loved by. Dennis for who he is, not what he has. Really, Dennis is a different mm -hmm. Don't even say that. It's different. Don't say that. Dennis is a lot different from GK. There's no comparison here. Can't you see? <laughs> How would I know? How would I know? For all I know. All the cars, all the houses, and all the people he claims are his. Mm. I just vanish tomorrow. I might just disappear. She is a lot better than Dennis. Mm -mm. No, no, darling. Don't even better. say that. Don't You're say that better. again. Don't worry. I'm sure Dennis will come and smooth things out very soon. He'll come. He'll come and sort things out in no, no time. He, come. he, he come. will, trust me. My heart's get a beat, you knocked me off my feet. I wished you'd be mine. A real love is one that is true. A real love is someone like you. A real love is one that is true. A real love is someone like you. I was so depressed till you stepped into the room. Rita, I understand how he feels. He hasn't got to know what Trisha did to him. 
Yes, good afternoon, my son. Ma, good afternoon. What's the matter? Uh, Dennis, your mother is very upset about your decision not to marry. No, Dad. If it's on my decision not to get married, I think it's final. What? How did you know my dead body do this? Your father and I gave birth to you, so shall you give us grandchildren? Take it easy on him, Rita. Oh, can't you see he's just coming back home? Tell what is it? Look at this. I demand that you get married and give us grandchildren. Mom, get married to who? I mean, who do I marry? Tell me who. Every girl you see on the street, before you tell her I love you, she's already in love with you. I mean, they're all jumping and hopping around for, for better days. Just imagine what Trisha did to me. At the time when I needed her, needed her most, after she just, I mean, wrecked me and took everything. I mean, mommy, forget it. Is Trisha the only girl around that asked me? I mean, there are 1,001 girls out there. I'm just waiting for your hand in marriage. Dad, please tell mom to drop this marriage issue for now. I don't want to get married now, please. Let me come back here. I'm, I'm talking to you. Don't look at me. Come back here. Rita! Come back here. What is the matter with you? Then this is an adult. He can make decisions on his own. Women. You should give me grandchildren. I want grandchildren. You got grandchildren, eh? All, all, all our men have grandchildren. Listen, bro. I think these ladies are just after our money and not us. That's terrible, though. I mean, it's quite ugly the way they fall like a pack of cards. I mean, just for money. It's terrible. You can even have all the ladies. I mean, have all the ladies as far as the cash still flow. I thought you can buy them all. Yeah, but what about true love? I mean, what about real love? Henry, you, you know I'm contemplating marriage and I'm asking, where is true love? I mean, not all these girls jumping around our streets. And how do you tend to find out with you like this? What do you mean? How do you mean me like this? I mean, bro, you know now, you know your your usual expensive wares, your cruising expensive car side there. In fact, bro, see, every woman would jump at you, pretending they love you, but you know they don't. That's true. That's true. And so, what are you going to do now? Let's wait and see.
Who is that, Susan? It's Dennis. I don't think I want to talk to him. Why? Why won't you want to talk to him? Take him out. Okay, please. So, Susan, hello, Susie. Uh, hello? 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 Yeah, hello, Susan, please. Forgive me, Susan. I'm really sorry, please forgive me. I'm ready to do anything just to prove to you that I love you. Whatever you want, just, just say it. I will. Listen, Dennis. I'm not ready to listen to you, please. You lied to me. You made me go through hell just because you wanted to prove one stupid, lousy point. You know what, Dennis? Hello, 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 hello. I mean, you don't talk to him like that for any reason. Come on, Susan. Okay. I don't ever want to hear anything about Dennis again. I don't ever want to hear it. Susan. she reacted okay but you see ever since then she has not been to the office in fact her friend Buki said that Susan may have traveled I suggest you go and see Buki herself you see James I have tried see, I've tried to talk to her I've tried to call her on the phone she, she won't just listen to me I, I mean... know Dennis be calm okay her reaction is full based on what she called a betrayal on your part. I know, I know. I know with time she will understand, okay? Just take it easy with her, huh? I tell you, relax. You know now, the good old days. <laughs> I'll see you. Oh my God, I'll see you. It's making your hair. In case you call, if you call, if you scale through, you call. One time, one time. All right, I'll see you.
No, she's not. She's been gone for a few days now. Is everything okay? It's a long story. And I, I told her the truth about myself. She got angry and walked out on the relationship. Oh my God, she must be really hurt then. I know. I know, Buki, and that's why I need you. I need you to help me find her. I need you to help me tell her my story. To tell her I'm sorry. I mean, she's all I'm living for. Honestly, I never meant to hurt her. And I, I could revert everything, okay? I could just go back some steps if it will make her come back to me. It's not like I really... She's my world. She, she means everything to me. I mean, booking my world is empty without her. Please, Bookie. I'm begging. Please, just, just... It's okay. It's okay, Dennis. It's all right. Hmm? I'll do everything I can to help you. I don't even know where she is. I have to find her first. Oh. But not to worry. Okay? Not to worry. I'll help you. Alright? Okay. I'll never forget this day. I'll get back to you. I promise. Sorry. Give him another chance, okay? Sorry. He lied to me, okay? Tell his lied to me. Come on, Susan. I'm sure he didn't mean to. I'm sure he didn't mean to hurt you. Hmm? Give him another chance. He's full of pretense and lies. Susan, you still love Dennis, don't you? Hi, Cynthia. Hello. Well, I'm fine. Actually, Dennis, I must apologize for what happened between us. You see, sometimes we women behave strangely, you know? I see. Actually, I had been wanted to, you know, contact you, but I mean, I, could, I couldn't... What do you want my contact for? I wouldn't mind you, you know, calling you on the phone, if only you could give me your number. I mean, I'm sorry, you know? I'm sorry. Please understand. Sorry, Cynthia. I... I don't give my number to strangers. But I've said I'm sorry. I mean, I'm sorry too. Susan. Brother, 
that Suzanne is not worth this. She's not worth this stress. All, all I'm saying here is that with your money, you can even buy me toward if you want to. Listen, Henry. Suzanne is. She's. She's a different girl, you know? She, she, she's quite mannered, well cultured, you know? She's not just a babe, you know? She's just a w virtuous woman, somebody you want to be with. You know what I mean? No, no you don't understand. <laughs> don't understand. Listen, 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 listen. Senior brother, I just have to make this point clear. As far as I am concerned, no woman is special. You know what makes them special? How rich you are. Brother, believe me, by the time your mother is gone, they develop things and go, right? Fly. Fine. Fly away. I'm on my way out, so you join me out, okay? What of your food? Go ahead and enjoy. Uh, okay, I'm not eating. If you're not eating again. Ever since we got in here, you've become unnecessarily moody. What is the problem? Honey, it's about the 30,000 I told you about. I need it badly. I need to buy some books. Listen, Janet, you should understand me. Right now, I don't have the money, okay? I hate it when you can't meet my demands. Janet, you don't expect me to go and steal to meet your demands, okay? What difference does it make how you get the money? Henry, of what use are you to me if you can't take care of me? Do you know what he just said now? Do I look like someone who has lost her senses? Look here, Henry. I don't indulge myself with your stupid, penniless love. Excuse me. Oh, Janet, please stop that. Janet, I don't have the money now. Okay? But that doesn't mean that I will not give it to you. Alright? Then you can come back for me when you can find the money.
to thank you for showing concern for me. I mean, it just seems as if you're my doctor and I'm your patient. <laughs> for sure, I am not a doctor, you know. I just been a while since I saw you. I mean, the last time I brought you home. So I kind of got worried. And I wanted to know how you're feeling and how you're doing. Well, as you can see, I'm a lot better now. Yeah. I actually resume work tomorrow. Really? Yeah, I so look, look much more stronger than the previous day. See, Dennis, I'd like to repay your kindness by coming to pay you a visit once I'm settled back into work. I will be nice, Susie. Um, I gotta go now. Thank you. Looking forward to seeing you. Yes, come in. What a pleasant surprise. Welcome to Scan. Leslie, um, please don't be surprised. I thought it was going to be difficult finding a place. Oh, it turned out to be very easy, yeah. Mm. yeah. That's good. <laughs> what do I offer you? Well, any soft drink will be alright. Preferably cook. Um, I can afford a malt, a stout, whatever, if you don't mind. I know, cook will be just fine. Besides, I don't drink alcohol. <sighs> okay, um... I'll be right back. Thank you. Dennis! Today you can't stay Dennis! Come, 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 come! Come, 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 come! Why have you refused to pay me, Dennis? Why have you refused to pay me? Yes? Have I committed any crime allowing you to eat for our credit? No, but please, I'll pay you this money for me this week. No, 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 that's what you have always been saying. When you were always coming to eat in my shop, you were pleading. And now the money has risen to 1,850. You cannot pay. You cannot pay. Bring down your voice now. The neighbors will hear this. Oh, oh. Now the neighbors are here, so. Now the neighbors are here. Today you must pay my money. If not, the whole of this are getting the neighbors here. Then it's. Why have you chosen to embarrass me like this? You call that embarrassment? Just wait for the real embarrassment. Mama, what's all this all about? Dennis, 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 it's Dennis. It's Dennis. For the past one month now, he has been eating food in my shop on credit. And he hasn't paid. I'm taking this television for my money. Dennis, is that true? Oh, God, landlord. Yeah, I will. Hey! boy, please. Give him some more time to pay. Don't take the television away, eh? Ha! Dennis. Um, madam, please, eh? Be a bit more patient. Once he receives his salary, he'll pay you your money. Please. Just thank your landlord. Thank your landlord and this auntie here. If not, I will have taken your television away. Idiot. And the next time I call here, eh, if you never pay, you'll see what I will do to you. Idiot. Then yes. If not for me, now this man will have taken your television away. That is how you'll be owing money up and down here and there. 
même si la pas qu'on dise qu'on parle, je laisse mal. Ever since I met you, uh, something started inside of me. But I, I, I couldn't just say it to you because I, I didn't want to break anybody's relationship. But I've always wished for somebody with so much love and care, you know? Susie? Please say something. Honestly, Dennis. See, ever since Chike treated me with so much cruelty, I've had a problem with men and relationships. Chike appeared to be nice. So nice at first. But somehow, somewhere along the line, he changed. I understand how you feel, Susan. I understand how you feel. And I'm beginning to think we share something in common. I mean, kind of, we share some similarities here. I believe ever since I've been dating or having girlfriends, I've never really seen any of them that loves me for me. It's been difficult, you know. Susan, no matter how hard we try, we can never find real love like we share here. I'm glad that you were mine. A real love is one that is true. A real love is someone like you. A real love is one that is true. A real love is someone like you. A real love is one that is true. A real love is someone like you. I'm very sorry. Honey, I, I'm sorry. I, I, I got you too worried overnight, okay? Sorry. You should have at least let me know. Oh, yes. We had to do over time yesterday. I mean, it, it stayed over to, to the night, okay? So I had to sleep here. Um, I intended this morning to come to the house and see you. I'm sorry, okay? Sorry. Uh, you're right. 
I'm waiting for the puff woman. Ah, I got body welcome, sir. It's Uncle Algari. This is uh, Susan, the lady I introduced to you as my fiance. Susan, that's Mr. Body, my boss. He's the contractor here. After you, what a beautiful lady you are. <laughs> I hope you are taking good care of me. Okay. Um, Dennis, I will have to leave both of you now. Okay. When you are through with her, please try and see her. Okay. Oh, he really seems to like you. Yeah, he can't do without me here. Yeah. And whenever he comes here, then he's see Dennis. Ah. Yes. I'll see you when I come back at night. I'm okay, it's just that puff puff woman, I have nothing to do. No. So we embrace the smell of your perfume. You're the only one that will touch me on my feet. The only one that makes my life complete. I'm glad that you were mine. I'm all right. It's one that is good. That's good. It's good. Mr. Bode was not around, so I had to stand in for him. Yeah, Mr. Bode. What? Susie, what about Bode? What happened? Mr. Bode tried to seduce me the other day. He gave me a ride home. What? It was nothing. He tried and he didn't succeed. Are you sure he didn't do anything for me? Come on. Fine, he talked and talked and talked and talked. I mean, I told him of, I told him of very well. And that's it. Dennis, I'm here for my rent. Good evening, sir. There's nothing good about this evening. Dennis, I'm here for my rent. Two months' rent. Oh, uh, Gala, well, you know, I'm, I've been trying to put this money together so I can pay everything. I'm working hard, Ogala. Oh, honestly, I'm sorry that I'm not, I've not paid. Ogala, oh, Lord, please, uh, give us some time. It's just that his salary has not been paid. Yes. Shut up, I'm not talking to you. Dennis, this matter is getting too long. I have been patient. In fact, over patient. If I don't get my money now, we prepare what happened next. What to you? Okay, okay, wait. Okay, wait. Please, eh? Just wait for me here. Give me a minute. I'm coming. Dennis. Dennis. You, Dennis. Oh, okay, I'm okay, begging now. I will deal with you. You're dealing with me already. How is that it? You will not, you are a madman. around so the bastard he fired you because I refused his advances how can you be so wicked how can you be the worst is that they said they're not paying a salary till next weekend I don't have any money with me so how do I cope I mean how do I feed how do I take care of you how do I take care of us what's happening to us
Don't despair, okay? Everything is going to be alright. The God that brought us together is not going to let us suffer like this. How do we eat? How do we feed? I was depending on the Omega salary so we could, I mean, cope till I get another job. Now. I know this hardship is not going to last forever. I'm due to collect my salary tomorrow. We'll survive on that, okay? We'll survive. Okay. I know we'll survive. Yeah. I wish you'd be mine. 
into something beautiful between us. A real love is one that is true. A real love is someone like you. I was so depressed till you stepped into the room. So impressed by the smell of your You're the only one that puts me on my feet The only one that makes my life complete I'm glad that you were mine I realize it's one that is true Discovered each other, isn't that okay? Listen to me. You're a coward and you're a liar. I don't ever want to see you near me again. And if you ever come near me, I swear to God, the consequences will be funny. Do you understand me?
understand the way you feel. But you shouldn't get yourself drunk over it. Dad. I thought I was doing the right thing. I'm not even sure anymore. My son, Dennis. See, women. <laughs> women are like soft bread. Give them time. They will rise to your expectation. And now she will later understand. Hmm? Just don't worry. Um, please, go to bed. Okay? It's late. You get it drunk. Make it like this. It's, it's not good. Be a man. Don't worry. Just.
Don't give me that look. Why shouldn't I, Susan? Why shouldn't I? Have you gone out of your mind or something? What's that shameless gigolo doing here? Eh? At least I know him. He's a womanizer, yes. <laughs> but I can understand it and I can deal with it. But with Dennis, you can never tell. Today he's a, a struggling young nice man. Tomorrow he's a rich young sportsman whose pleasure is to manipulate people who love him. Do you know what, Buki? I have decided to stick with the devil I know.
I said, what are you doing? Are you asking me what am I doing here? What are you doing here, my friend? And who is this guy you're sitting with? He's not what you think, really. He's my brother that just came back from this. Excuse me. Who is your brother? And who is this fool here? What did you say? You call me a fool? You are a fool. Wait, I tell you to your face, you are a fool. Now look at yourself and look at who's the fool. You are a fool. I said, shut up, man. Hey, fool. When I'm talking, don't talk. You idiot. Yeah, you shut up. Don't talk to me like that. Don't shout at me. You know who you are talking to. So you are saying, now look at yourself. You are sitting down here with my girl and you are asking me who, is who your I am. Who's your girl? Who is your girl? She is my girl. Not your girl, my friend. Who is your girl? She is my girl. Yes, she is your girl. I'm supposed to take that to my shut up, shut up. You are a fool. Shut up. Shut up, dude. Shut up. Shut up. You can't talk. You are an idiot. You are an idiot. You have to go to sit down with my girl and you are telling me who is your girl? Hey, you know what? You know what I feel like doing to you now? What I feel like going in your brain. You can't do but that. But I'm not going to do you nothing. You can't do nothing. I finish with my girl. Hey, you come back here. It's said that I'm off to the mechanic to pay. Go back in no time. Hello, Dennis. Yeah, this is Bookie. Oh, Bookie. Nice to hear from you. I mean, it's close to call at last. Yes, um, can I come and see her now? Uh, not really, Dennis. Not exactly. Actually, Susan has gone back to Chike. What? Actually, he proposed to her and she accepted. As I was speaking right now, they're on their way to the airport. They're going to Washington to get married. No, no, that's not possible now. That's not dawn. It's never dawn. I mean, it's never. How could she do a thing like that? Uh, oh, okay, where are you now? I'll, I'll wait for you in front of my house. It's don't leave home, okay? I'll, I'll, I'll join you right in a minute. I'll join you right in a minute. Um, um, let me see. Um, um, Boogie just called me that Susan is on her way out of the country with her former boyfriend, Chike. What? Can you imagine? You just tell that I'll be on my. Let me just see how I can talk out of it, okay? Okay. Should I come with you? Don't bother. Let me see. I want to leave my stuff. Isn't that crazy? What's going on here? Look, Susan, we have a plane to catch, okay? Let's go. Susie, why are you doing this? I'm sorry if I hurt you. Please forgive me if you think I deceived you. But it's worth it because I found one woman that has changed my life. I found you, Susie. No. You found nothing, Dennis, but your own selfish satisfaction. You had your chance and you blew it. Well, too bad. And goodbye. Okay, let's go. Susan! I am not afraid. Eat on my own. And I don't care 
if I'm right or wrong I live my life the way I feel No matter what, I'll keep it real today It's time for me to do it on my own Are we? 